so big, so much to do and see. I'm a young prospect of prodigy. I can't succeed in being you. So you be you and I'll be me. I'll be me. I just like you, I'm gonna be me. I just like you, I'm gonna be me. Well, hello, friends. So glad that you can join us today. It looks like we have a message from one of our special viewers on the computer. Let's see who it is. Hello, Kujo. My name is Lucas. And I have a question. How do you make elephant toothpaste? Thank you so much for your question. Let's try to figure this out together. Today we're going to find out how to do an experiment big enough for an elephant to use. Okay, but first we need to get a couple of ingredients in order to make this happen. We need to get soap, hydrogen peroxide, food coloring, yeast, water, a bowl, a spoon, uh, and towels to clean up. Oh yeah, and I can't forget, we need to have a glass jar. Oh yes, and I can't forget, any single time that you're doing an experiment, you need to make sure that you grab an adult that is handy in order to help you complete the experiment. Hope you have a lot of fun. Step one, we will put the soap, the hydrogen peroxide, and food coloring all together in a glass bottle. Please note, to give it a strip, kind of like what toothpaste looks like, we will have to put the color, the food coloring on the side of the bottle and we won't mix it. Step two, we will then mix the water and the yeast in a separate bowl with a spoon. Step three, we will pour the yeast and water mix into the glass bottle that already contains the soap, food coloring, and hydrogen peroxide mix. And step four, voila, we have our elephant toothpaste. Why does it work? What makes the foam appear? Well, when the hydrogen peroxide comes into contact with the yeast, it starts breaking down into water and oxygen. Oxygen is a gas and it wants to escape from the liquid. The dish soap traps these oxygen gas bubbles and it forms the foam that you see. That's how elephant toothpaste works. How cool was that? Didn't it look like toothpaste that you use in the morning time when you brush your teeth? So now you know how to make elephant toothpaste using a couple of items that you can get from around your house. Lucas, great question. Keep them coming in. And I'm so glad when you ask me these questions because secretly I have a lot of fun too. If you have a question that you want to go ahead and ask me, Please shoot a video stating your name, your age, your location. And of course, don't forget to ask your question. Your parents can join in on the fun as well. Send your video at the email address below and we'll do our best to answer all of your curious questions. It's time for me to go, but I'm looking forward to seeing you all really soon. Remember to be kind be brave and to be curious, but most importantly is to be yourself. If you like our videos, please click on the subscribe button and don't forget to follow us on YouTube, on Twitter, on Instagram, and on Facebook. For more information about our show, please visit us at KujosKidZone.com. Bye for now.
so big, so much to do and see. Let's go see. I'm a young prospect of prodigy. A prodigy, a prodigy. I can't succeed in 